I would like to say that if you haven't done Over the Edge before, you need to do this next year. It was the best birthday present ever. Happy birthday, Nikki. Thanks, Thanks so much for all you do for Special Olympics. Olympics. All right, folks, coming up next on Rope C, this is Kyle Carioca. If you recognize the name, it's because Kyle is actually this event's coordinator. Kyle works for Special Olympics Hawaii, but has also gone out and raised, uh, through his friends and family, over $3,000 this year for Special Olympics Hawaii. Again, raising funds as a repeller for Over the Edge. Kyle would like his nickname today to be Awesome. Awesome. Awesome Karaoke. Kind of has a nice ring to it. Also, coming down right now on rope A, this is Joel Savoy. And Joel, I hope I'm pronouncing your last name correctly, Savoy. That's right? All right. So I think I got it right. So Joel, uh, Joel's nickname today is Unit 2. Does that make sense to some of the folks back here? Okay. But it does make sense to at least his friends that are here. He's the engineering manager here at the Sheraton Waikiki. So this is his, this is his home right here. And what motivated him to sign up for the Over the Edge is fear. Interesting. So the most adventurous thing Joel has ever done is walking on lava. And Joel would like to thank the U.S. Army. And his last words or thoughts are, yeah. Kyle's occupation, he is our professional money beggar taking orders from Nancy Patella first. And what motivated him to sign up for the edge? He wanted to make sure he met his budget. And he's a proud employee of Special Olympics Hawaii for the last four years. He wants to thank his assistant Harley for all his help, his friends and family for donating. He wants to thank everyone for donating and raising funds for supporting our athletes. He is amazed at the generosity and support of our repellers and their donors. We'll be back next year, he says, in 2013. If you didn't get a chance to go over this year, please let us know how we can connect you with this event for next year. It's never too early to get rolling. Kyle, can you hear me? Once again, Kyle, awesome, Carioca coming down rope C. Joel Savoy coming down rope A. Kyle, you have a few hecklers down here at the bottom. Only close family and friends, though. So this is Kyle's second or third year doing this. I think he had to do it because he got his dad to do it the first year. And once his dad did it, and Kyle knew he had to do it. Isn't that right, pretty much? But I do know that Kyle does not particularly like heights, and he doesn't particularly enjoy going over the edge, but he does it every year so he can raise funds for Special Olympics Hawaii. And Kyle, for today, and today only, we will call you awesome. Again, Joel Savoy, engineering manager at the Sheraton Waikiki on rope A, and now on rope B, coming up, this is Stacy Matheson. A little, little bit about, about Stacey, Stacey she's self-employed. She wanted to support our awesome organization. organization. She, she did it in 2010, 2010 so this is her second time doing it over the edge. edge. She, she is uh, not fond of heights. This event is the most adventurous thing she's done. done. She, she wants to thank her family and friends who support her crazy adventures. adventures. And, and her final thoughts are, lucky I live boy, and God gave you two hands, one to help yourself and one to help others. There's always time to give back. Words, words live by, by, by Stacey Matheson, Matheson. She's, she's on the road beat. Right, right here, here coming, coming down, down. This, this is Kyle, Kyle. awesome, Carioca. Kyle, Kyle is our event coordinator for Over the Edge. Has, has been since the inception of the event four years ago. 
And Kyle, now, this, this is your second or third, third time, time over here. Number three? Third, third time. time. And Kyle has raised over $3,000 personally, personally for this event this year. year. And, and the, the event, event we expect, expect to raise is approximately over $120,000 this year as a total. With over 100 propellers. Congratulations, Kyle. You have to safely down. Over the edge. Coming down on row A. Again, we do have... Joel Savoy, Savoy, engineering, engineering manager, manager here at the Sheraton, Sheraton Waikiki. And then again on row B, Stacy Matheson, who is a second time propeller, having gone over the first time in 2010. Joel, are you enjoying yourself up there? So, so if Joe is the engineering, engineering manager, I understand he's probably, I'm assuming he's probably responsible for the, the uh, structural integrity of the building, building and things like that. that. Is that correct, Joe? All right. So, so you're kind of getting an inspection from a different side this time, right? All right, All right once, once again, again on row B, B that's Stacy Matheson, Matheson coming over now. now. Second time, time propeller. propeller. <laughs> folks, we still have another dozen propellers still coming over. over. If, if you're waiting, waiting for some of these folks, these are the folks we expect to see shortly. shortly. Brittany out there. Tom Zacklin. Ronald Radsky. John Brody. George Choi. GG Auditor. JJ Johnson, 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 Teresa Davis, Teresa Manoha, and, and Justin Akamini. And Joel Savoy has made it safely down. down. Congratulations, Joel, for, for making it safely over the edge. Did you enjoy yourself? Awesome. awesome. And, and again, again, this is Stacey Stacey Madison, Madison coming down, down right now in the blue shirt. Again, again Stacey, Stacey has one of the better quotes of the day. God gave you two hands, one to help yourself, one to help others. There's always time to give back. Congratulations, Joel. So, so you work here at the Sheraton Wiki? Yeah. And did you enjoy that? Yeah. Interesting, Interesting uh, perspective, perspective getting the, the, the building from a different angle. angle. Thanks, Joel, again, again, thanks, thanks for the share everyone can keep for their continued, continued support. support. Stacy, how are you doing up there? Up there? Okay, and Stacy's a little, little bit stuck. stuck. All right, All folks, folks next, next coming up on Rope, rope C. This is Brittany, I think.
Make sure you see that gold device. It's just sliding up and down free. Okay, we're going to let up on the play a little bit. Now you can continue on our bell, okay? Again, on a rope here right now, this is Stacy Matheson. Stacy is self employed. She wants to. And she wants to support our awesome organization. She did this in 2010, had a blast. And she wanted to um, thank her family and friends who support all of her crazy adventures. Her involvement with special employees is that she has several friends who are participants and athletes. And again, again, this is Stacey Matheson, Matheson making her way down, down right now, her, her second time repelling with Over the Edge. Edge. And All right, All right Stacey, Stacey, how are you doing? doing? Awesome. All right, All right, folks, coming, coming down, down now on rope C. This, this is Brittany on thing. Now, now Brittany, Brittany, apparently you've got, got a lot of followers on the live stream. We've got, got three messages, messages from the live stream already. already. So, so we've got, got one message. message. Shout, Shout out to Brittany on thing. Go get a B. This is almost as exciting as being there in person. You rock from mom and dad. dad. Also, also, another one. one. Kathy Plate says, I'm proud of you. And I'm right here watching. Way to go. And then also, your godmother in Humboldt County, California, is giving your best wishes as well. So those are all folks that are watching Brittany on the live stream. And she's on rope C. On rope A, we have Thomas Zacklin. Thomas's occupation is picking up cans on the beach. I don't make this up, folks. I just basically read what they give me. Um, she's, she's signing up for Over the Edge, edge. She, she wants to help, he wants to help those who need it. A little bird told him about Over the Edge. edge. The most, most adventurous thing, thing he's ever done, done is sitting in traffic. traffic. And, and the, the folks, folks that he wants to thank are all those watching, hoping the rope will come loose. His last words or thoughts are, milk was a bad choice. His last comment is, look, he thinks he can fly. Thomas may be a part-time comedian in his off time. We'll find out when he comes down. Again, Stacey Matheson has made it safely down. Congratulations, Stacey. Thank you for coming back as a repeller for the second time. We appreciate you supporting us. And is there anybody you would like to thank out there? Thanks, Thanks Stacey. Stacey. We, we are leaving for live streaming right, right now on 808. Oh, hi. It's a good thing I didn't call on 64. <laughs> no. Thanks, Thanks, Stacey. Stacey. All, right, All right, folks, right, right now, once again, we have on row C, Brittany on thing, and on row A, Thomas Zachlin. Folks, if, if you are here supporting either one of those, those folks, if I mispronounce their last names in any way, please let me know.
Brittany, if you can hear me, your mom and dad just sent this message, and their message is for Brittany. They said, Shimmy B beat him. So your mom and dad on the live stream basically are encouraging you to beat Thomas down to the ground. And then Brittany, just so you also know, your godmother from Humboldt County, California, also called in. Oh, Brittany got a little too excited. She got stuck. Started going a little too fast. So Brittany, just while you're waiting for them, just so your godmother also called or texted in or emailed our folks with 808. And then, and then also, <laughs> your, your cousin, cousin no, no, sorry, Kathy, Kathy Platten says, says, I'm proud of you and I'm right here watching, watching. Way, way to go. go. So, so, all, all kinds, kinds of folks watching Brittany on a live stream, stream with, with Channel 808. And your godmother also has gotten into the action and apparently just put a bet on you to be Thomas. We believe Thomas is a comedian based on his comments on his answer sheet. We're not sure. We'll talk to him when he gets down. But again, this is Thomas exactly coming down right now on rope A. And Brittany, I think, coming down on rope C. Brittany is an Annie. She gets paid to play peekaboo and blow bubbles all day. She says life is good. She's motivated, motivated to do this because it's a once-in-a-lifetime once experience. She wants to say that she's, she's able to jump off skyscrapers on a regular basis, basis but this is actually her first time. Uh, she is a volunteer for Special Olympics Hawaii, and she'd, and she'd like to thank her friends and family for donating and tuning in to watch. And she wanted to really uh, make sure that she could prove she could do this without wetting herself. She also wants to thank her friends for the vote of confidence. Her last, last word was breathe, Mama, breathe, breathe, and I love you too. So again, Brittany, you've got, got all kinds of supporters out there, there that are watching your live stream. stream. Your, your godmom God says, says, slow down, down Thomas, Thomas, she's your, your friend. friend. <laughs> so I'm, so I'm assuming, assuming Thomas and Brittany know each other. other. <laughs> but, but Thomas, we haven't got, got any messages, messages for you, buddy. buddy. Well, actually, we did, again, from Brittany's Scott mom, that said, slow down. So, so I, think I think Brittany's mom has a big bet on this one. one. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so we, we have, have Brittany, Brittany the Danny coming, coming down, down right now, with Thomas, Thomas, the can, can collector, collector, coming down. down. And, and once, once again, again coming, coming down on rope C, congratulations, congratulations to Brittany, Brittany Ah Thing, our professional peekaboo blowing bubbles for person, for making it safely over the edge and being a volunteer for Special Olympics Hawaii. Thanks so much, Brittany. And, and once, once again, again, Thomas is actually, Thomas, Thomas is almost, almost all the way down. down. Again, again, Brittany is also raised for $1,000 for Special Olympics, Olympics Hawaii and also a volunteer, volunteer. So, so thanks, thanks so much to Brittany. Brittany. Thanks, Thanks so much, much to Thomas for supporting Special Olympics Hawaii and for going over the edge today. We hope you guys had a great time. time. And, and just, just for the record, record Brittany, Brittany win, did win by about 15 seconds. seconds. So. <laughs> also on the live stream, Brittany's godmother and mom says, love you, Thomas, you rock. So Thomas, you got some love from Brittany's godmother and the mother. Brittany Thomas, Thomas, would either of you like to, to on our live stream, stream you want to say hi to some folks, folks or thank anybody? Brittany Thomas, our friends, Dad, um, Andy, everybody that I love, if they show up, 
Thanks, Thanks so much, so much once again to Brittany, Brittany and, and Thomas. Thomas. Congratulations, you guys, for going over the edge successfully. We appreciate your continued support, Rob, especially Olympic Hawaii. Folks, we do have, again, about some more colors coming over today. Again, if you're standing by waiting for some of those folks, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more colors today. We expect to be seeing Ronald Ratsky, John Rodney, Dora Choi, G.T. Auditor, J.J. Johnston, Teresa Davis, Teresa Abanoha, and Justin Akabini coming over shortly. Again, over the edge is a fundraiser for a special Olympic Hawaii providing year-round sports training and competition for over 2,700 individuals with intellectual disabilities here in the state of Hawaii. A common, common misbelief about, about special Olympics is that we serve, serve only children, and when in fact we serve both children and adults. In fact, we have athletes still participating in our program into their 60s, 70s, and even a couple of athletes into their 80s, believe it or not. And we have athletes as young as three and four years old that are participating in our program. So we have the full spectrum of athletes that are participating in our program. Athletes of all the different ability levels. Oh, and the program, program is free of charge to them, which is why we do uh, a very comprehensive fundraising program and put it over the edge. All right, folks, coming up next on the rope, rope B, this is Dora Choi. Do we have any fans of Dora Choi on here? All right. Dora Choi. And I'll say it again when she gets a little closer down so she can hear you guys scream. Again, Again, Dora is on rope, rope B, and we've got somebody coming over on rope A. We'll get that name in just a second. All right, All right coming, coming up on rope, rope C, C, this is Gigi Auditor. Nice costume. Do we, we have, have any uh, fans, friends, or family of Gigi Auditor out here today? Yeah. All right. All right. Huh? So... Apparently, Apparently a couple of their, their friends, friends came over and added some notes to their, 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 their sheets, sheets of paper here and my talking points. And uh, apparently Dora and Gigi are both part-time pole dancers. I don't know if it's true or not. I swear it's true. A little bit about Dora, she's an architect with the state, for better or worse. Her motivation is an adrenaline rush. She's heard about over the edge of the grapevine. The most, most adventurous thing she's, she's ever done is skydiving and flying trapeze. I don't, I don't think we've had any other trapeze artists today. That's the first. first. She, she wants, wants to thank Gigi for being a solo adventurer and Galad for always being there. So Galad by his emotion is out here today supporting his friends. Her last thoughts or words are yay, it's about time. And so Dora is going over the edge with Gigi and her good friends. Uh, Gigi is in construction with Pacific Industrial Coatings. The reason that she signed up for Over the Edge is she likes tossing herself off of things. And she heard about Over the Edge from her teammate Dora Choi. And her company supported Team Hogan Heroes of Hulu Mon School at the last Summer Games. So that's a group that participated with the Special Olympics Hawaii Summer Games. The most, most adventurous thing she's, she's ever done is she's ride a Harley, she's flown a plane, she's jumped out of everything that flies. She'd like, like to thank Mike Chu of MRC Roofing and all the awesome guys at Pacific Industrial Coatings. Her last words or thoughts are her husband and best friend, Red Coleman, told me to go jump off the building. And so she did. And again, this jump is for the team Hogan Heroes of Uumanu Elementary School. And up there with them is Jessica Johnston. Jessica is also known as Jessica Rabbit. And is also a pole dancer slash aerialist. So we have Jessica, Gigi, and Dora. They are all pole dancers slash aerialists. And flying trapezists. I don't even know if that's a word, flying trapezists. Trapeze artists. So a little bit about Jessica. Jessica works as the J. Crew Story Director at Ala Moana. 
and she signed up so she could support Special Olympics Hawaii. This is her first involvement with our organization, but she has also been a skydiver, and her last words or thoughts are hold on and look down. So, so three friends, friends Dora Choi, Gigi Otter, and Jessica Johnston, our pole dancing aerialist, flying trapeze artist, slash skydivers. Dora in her spare time is architect. Gigi in her spare time is in construction with Pacific Industrial Coatings and Jessica as a J Crew store director. These three look, sound like thrill seekers and are making the rappel down together. So Dora, Dora against, against their, their team is the Team Honeybees. Dora Choi raised, Dora raised over $1,200 for Special Olympics Hawaii. Gigi Otter raised $1,000 for Special Olympics Hawaii. And Jessica Johnson has also raised $1,000 for Special Olympics Hawaii. Again, that's Team Honeybees coming down now. And look, look at these amazing outfits these ladies, ladies have on. And I think you'll appreciate them more as they get closer. Team Honey Bees coming down now. now. Again, on rope B, we've got Dora Choi. On rope C, Gigi Otter. And on rope A, Jessica Johnson. Ladies, um, again, somebody else decided to add some items to your uh, face sheet here. And so, um, again, we wanted to announce that Dora... Gigi and Jessica are pole dancing aerialist trapeze artists. All thrill seekers who are who have raised money for Special Olympics Hawaii uh, obviously enjoy life and uh, are having a great time today. We hope. Ladies, you guys have a good time up there. Awesome. And repelling with some great friends, obviously. Again, Dora Choi, architect with the State of Hawaii. Wants to thank Gigi for being a solo adventurer and Galad for always being there. Uh, and then there's Gigi who wants to thank Mike Chu of MRC Roofing and all the awesome guys at Pacific Industrial Coatings, as well as her husband and best friend Red Coleman. And, and Jessica, Jessica Johnson. Johnson. Congratulations, all three have come down together. And we want to thank the honey Jessica, Jessica Johnson, Gigi Auditor. And Dora Choi for being great propellers, great sports, awesome outfits, and for raising money for Special Olympics Hawaii. Again, this is our aerialist, trapeze artist, slash pole dancing crew. They look awesome in their great outfits. I'm not really sure exactly what they are. Kind of got the circuit delay look going. Close enough. Close enough. All, right. All right, All right, then you, you guys, guys can join us over here real quick. quick. We, do we do have a live stream on Channel 808 going on right over here. So if you guys, guys want to come, come on this side, side you, you guys, guys can thank anybody that you would like to thank. Ladies, you, ladies, you want to say, say a few, few words to thank anybody? I would like to thank the live right there. Ray Coleman. Ray Coleman, husband, best friend. MRC Roofing, Pacific Industrial Coatings, and Ladies and gentlemen, I do need to ask you, everybody is asking me, is it really true that you are a pole dancer slash trapeze artist slash aerialist? Yes? Yes. 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 Yes.
yes, yes it, it is confirmed, confirmed they, they are, are at least one of those things. things. And three more coming. Awesome. Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman. All right, we'll be looking forward to that. Congratulations, ladies. Thank you. Folks, is that Santa Claus on rope A? Toy maker. What motivated him to sign up for Over the Edge is Special Olympics. Uh, he, he, won, he heard about Over the Edge from DGG from Pacific Industrial Coding, one of our aerialists. Uh, most of the interesting thing he's ever done is he jumped off the stratosphere in Las Vegas. His last thoughts are this is much easier with reindeer. So. Nick, Nick Kloss going, going, up up on, going over, over on Road, road A right now, also known as John Brody. So we're, we're going to call him Nick, Nick for this afternoon. afternoon. And on Road C, we have Ron Radzki. <laughs> so, so once again, again guys, if I don't get the last name correct, let me know if I'm saying, saying it correctly. So a little bit about Ron. Ron. Ron's nickname is the Fat Daredevil. Ron the Fat Daredevil Radzki. Um, he is a U.S. Navy senior chief with the San Diego Hospital. Hospital. He's heard, heard about, about over the edge to Myrna, sent him an email, thanks, thanks chief. chief. Uh, the, the most, most adventurous thing he's ever done is underwater basket weaving after skydiving. He, he wants, wants to thank the San Diego DTD, Vina, Shelby, Jerry, and Ronnie. His last, last thoughts, thoughts are, I wish I would have worn the pens. My, my wife is going to get, get a big insurance check. check. And then and his, his last, last comments were, Navy Chief, Navy, Chief, Navy Pride, Smoochie, 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 Zmina. Hopefully that will be something for somebody out there. Again, that's Ron Ratsky, the Fat Daredevil. U.S. US Navy, Navy Senior Chief, Chief on the Rope C. And on, and on Rope B, B folks, folks, this is Justin Akamine. Coming over, over now, as he starts making his way down. down. Once, Once again, again, folks, Nick Claus coming down on Rope A, also known, known as John, John Brogan. Occupation, Toy Maker. Rope B, Justin Akamine. Justin, Justin is an anesthesia tech. So it sounded, sounded like, like a good year, year. did it last, last year, so I didn't come back, back again this year. year. The most, most adventurous thing, thing he has ever done is his bungee jumping, jumping in the field piece. He'd, He'd like, like to thank everyone that donated, including Tanya and Jesse. Last, last thoughts are right. nice. So again, so again Rope A, Nick Kloss, otherwise known as John Brody, on Rope C, Ron Ratsky, the Fat Daredevil on Rope B, Justin, Justin Akamini. Coming down, down right now, now on line A, Rope A. John, the nickname today is Nick, Nick, Nick Kloss, our toy maker from the North Pole. <laughs> and, and again, 
heard about this event from Gigi, one of our trapeze artists from the last round. How are you doing up there, Nick? This, this event, event has become, become so popular, popular that we even get folks, folks coming in from the North, North Pole to participate this year. year. Yeah. Oh, it, it is that, that almost that time, time of year coming around. around. Again, Again, coming down, down the road there right now, this is Nick Klaus, otherwise known as John Drogi. John, Drogi. John, John congratulations. You've done a fantastic, fantastic job, and you are safely down. down. Congratulations. John also, also raised thousand dollars for Special Olympics Hawaii. Big, Big shout out to John. John. Again, Again, coming down, down on road C, Ron Arachi. Got a lot of fans, fans down, down here. And again, Ron wants to thank the San Diego, San Diego DTD, DTD. Vina, Vina, Shelby, Shelby, Jerry, and Ronnie. Are you guys all here? here? Vina, Vina, Shelby, Shelby, Jerry, and Ronnie? Yes. yes. All right. And he's a U.S. Navy senior chief, so thanks, thanks so much, much for all you, for all you do. do. For us, Ron, Ron the fat Jerry of Ratchet coming down, down now. And it looks, looks like he's been caught up to by Justin Akamini, our anesthesia tech. All right, All right, folks, we are winding, winding down, down this afternoon. afternoon. I believe we, we just have, have a couple more propellers. I believe our last two of the day are going to be Teresa Davis and Teresa Abanoha. And also we do have Iris Thomas also coming down. So we have three more propellers coming down this afternoon. So we are final three as far as I am aware at this point, unless we get any last minute entries. All right, folks, right, here we go. Ron Ratchet, the, the fat Jerry, Jerry Devil coming down, down right now. No, 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 no sorry, just, just not coming down right now. Right now. We'll be our anesthesia tech. tech. Justin is flying down now. We want to thank everyone that donated, including, including Tanya and Jesse. And Justin has made it safely down. Congratulations, Justin. And halfway down, we do have Ron Ratchet. Unfortunately, Ron, your cheering crew has turned into more of like a heckling crew over there. There's a lot of love, but also a lot of comments flying down here, Ron. I'm not sure if you can hear or not. You probably don't want to. See, he turned his back on all you guys. He's not even looking at you. All right, folks, I do have a special guest with me. John O'Grodney, otherwise known as Nick Kloss. John, is there anybody you'd like to send a shout out to out there, please? Uh, just say uh, hi, hi to all the, the kids out there and uh, to my girlfriend, Julie. All right, all right and your girlfriend, girlfriend Julie, Julie. Thanks, thanks so much, much for supporting, supporting Special Olympics. We appreciate it. it. Our, Our toy maker from the North Pole right, right there. there. All right. Congratulations. And Mr. Ron Ratchet, you see chief. The United, United States, States Navy, Navy has successfully made it down. All right. Congratulations, Ron. Go Navy. All right. Go Navy. All right. All right. Justin, Justin, how was it up there? there? Justin, Justin, would you like to send a shout out to anybody out there? Out there? Oh, my right here. <laughs> all right. So, so all of your co workers from Queens Medical Center, QMC. My wife was an employee there as well. So, big mahalo to all the folks from QMC. They did great work. We appreciate all you guys do. Fantastic, Fantastic job, job. Just, just not coming in. Thank, Thank you for supporting Special Olympics Hawaii. Hawaii.
All right, All right folks, folks, next coming up on rope A is, is Miss Iris, Iris Thomas, Thomas, also with the United, United States, States Navy. Navy. If the Navy, Navy folks know her or want to stick around and support her, her. Uh, she's, she's coming down, down now. This is Ron Ratsky. You have a big cheer for today. today. Is anybody you want to send a shout out to and uh, give a thank you to? Yeah, thanks for my wife and thanks for the best at the entire Navy. Uh, Ron, what, what is, is the jet? Come on, that means. All right, so the, the best captain in the Navy. Navy. Congratulations, Ron. Thank, thank, you thank you so much for all your Olympics and for all the fans that have come out today. We appreciate you guys too. All right, folks, coming down right now on rope A is Miss Iris Thomas, also with the U.S. Navy. She's coming down right now on rope A is Miss Iris Thomas, Iris is with the U.S. Navy here at Pearl Harbor. Her friends and the cause motivated her to sign up for the edge, and. She, she is also a good skydiver. Ah, Iris, Iris is also a pole dancer. dancer. Two, two, does, does she do trapeze, trapeze also? Red? Red? Yes, yes, and trapeze. Wow, wow. Okay. okay. She'd, She'd like, like to thank, thank her mom and Jason. And Jason. Is Jason, Jason here? here? I don't know. Her, her last, last words or thoughts are, I'm amazing. I'm amazing. I am amazing. That's, That's what, what I Iris said. All right. right. So, so again, again, Iris, uh, like some of the ladies, ladies that just came down recently, recently also pole dancing trapeze artists. And Iris, Iris is on rope A. a. Just, just about to navigate the, the lip right, right there. And then, and then after, after Iris, I believe we have two final repellers today. And now we'll wrap up our Over the Edge for 2012. As, As we, we do start, start to wind down, down folks, once again, again we want to send a huge shout out to all our volunteers today for their amazing help. Many, many, many of our volunteers, our military, military volunteers as well, from the Army, Navy, Air Force, Air Force Coast, Coast Guard, and the Marines. Can't thank, thank them enough for their continued support year round, as well as many other corporate, corporate groups that come out to support us. us. I'd like, like to thank all of the repellers who have spent hours raising funds for the Special Olympics Hawaii program. Money that goes directly to support year round sports training and competition for over 2,700 Special Olympics athletes here in the state of Hawaii. We'd like to thank our ROPE volunteers. ROPE volunteers come from the Hawaii Army National Guard. They're local folks that serve in the military here with the National Guard. Uh, specifically, we'd like to thank the 93rd CST. Guys, what does CST stand for? Civil Support Team. Got it. Thank you. All right, and our last two repellers up there as well. On rope C, we have Teresa Abadonaha. And Teresa's nickname is Wonder Woman. I don't know if she goes by that all the time, but at least for today, she's Wonder Woman. And on rope B, we have Teresa Davis. And Teresa's nickname today is Weezy. I don't know if there's a backstory to that or not, but we've got Weezy, Wonder Woman, and Iris going over the edge now. I've just, just been informed that all three are recently out on parole. parole. <laughs> Congratulations <laughs> to them. I'm, I'm starting, starting not believing anything Red tells, tells me. me. It takes me a little, little while. while. All right, right again, Iris Thomas, Thomas with the U.S. Navy, Navy at Pearl Harbor. 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 <laughs> Teresa Abanoha is the Vice President, President of Communications at Honu Group, Group Incorporated. Incorporated. She's She's been, she, she has bungee jumped, jumped several times. times. She, she wants, wants to thank her friends, friends and family for donating. Um, she, she wants to be a superhero baddie. And she, she says thanks, thanks to all who participated. And Teresa Davis, also known as Weezy, is the American Savings Bank, Bank Wellness Coordinator. And she, she wants to uh, say that, that she's motivated, motivated because it's a great cause, it's fun, and she wants to support her team. And she's heard about going over the edge of her friends in her aerial class. So apparently they all do take aerial class together. Most, Most adventurous, adventurous thing she's, she's ever done is parachute. She, she wants to thank all of her generous friends who sent, sent her over the edge. Her last words are woo -hoo. And last, last final comments, the special, special people, people we are raising money for today overcome daily, daily challenges, challenges and struggles, and she is honored to be a part of their day. Teresa, that's, that's a great, great quote. quote. Again, Again, coming down together, Teresa Davis, Teresa Abanoha, and Iris Thomas.
also three awesome aerialists, pole dancers, and trapeze artists. We wrap up our final colors coming out today. We really, really want to thank Sheriff Waikiki for their fantastic hospitality, the use of this great hotel and resort, as well as their support logistically on a number of issues. Also, thanks to the folks here at Rumpfire for letting us take over their backyard, as well as the folks at Edge Waikiki on the other side of us. A big shout out to all of our volunteers for making this event possible. We'd like, like to thank, thank all of our, our sponsors, sponsors today. today. Again, Again, we'd, we'd like, like to thank, thank our mission partners, which include Cox Radio, Radio First, First Point Bank, Bank Hawaii, Hawaii, who's now the law enforcement court and the store. <laughs> And our event sponsors, Sheridan Waikiki and Edge of Waikiki, Armstrong Produce and Honolulu Freight Service, Safeway Scaffolding, Channel 808, Mahalo to Rusty and Melissa Chang and Channel 8, they're providing live internet streaming on the way to Edge of Waikiki. Uh, as noted by the number of messages we've received through them today, there's quite a number of folks that watch the live stream. Again, if you'd like to make a donation of any kind, come and see me. Um, you can join our fan club today. Coming down again, our final three repellers today on Rope A, Iris Thomas with the U.S. Navy at Pearl Harbor on Rope B, Teresa slash Wheezy Davis, American Savings Bank Wellness Coordinator, and on Rope C, Teresa Abadoha, also known as Wonder Woman, Vice President of Communications with the Honolulu Group Incorporated. They are friends, and they are all aerialists, and uh, continuing in the aerial position today by going over the edge. For our Special Olympics Hawaii, we would like, like to thank this entire group of folks that have been our last propellers today for all raising funds for our Special Olympics Hawaii program. Again, it goes to provide year-round sports training and competition for our Special Olympics athletes. Teresa, Teresa and Iris, we hope you guys are having a great time out there. If you're having a great time, give us a shout out or a thumbs up or some kind of notification. Something? Something? How are you guys doing up there? All right. They're kind of all just like Wonder Woman, so sort of kind of. There we go. All right, you got friends and family down here that are looking for some uh, acknowledgement. There we go. All right. You guys should pause for a second. Pose for the cameras. Keep the light on cameras. I want to catch you, you know. I'm going to get a good shot of you. So you can remember this day. There you go, ladies. You are our final three repellers today. And we know you've got some enthusiastic supporters down here on the ground. Again, on Rope A, Iris Thomas with the U.S. Navy at Pearl Harbor. Rope B, Teresa Weezy Davis. I'm not really sure what that one is. Looks interesting, though. And then on Rope C, Teresa Abanoha, Wonder Woman. All right. And Teresa is a Vice President of Communications with the Honda Group Incorporated. And, and they, they are, are all just recently, recently not on parole, parole apparently. <laughs> okay, Red told me I had to say that, so you guys go talk to Red about that last time. time. All right, I'm Rope C, safely down, and it's Teresa Abanoa. Congratulations, Teresa. Thanks so much for all your efforts raising funds for Special Olympics Hawaii and being a repellent and going over the edge. Also part of the Wonder Woman crew. 
with the U.S. Navy, Navy so we also, also want to thank her for her services as an Irish Thomas. Irish, what do you do for the Navy? Navy. You're what? You're, oh, you, oh, you work, work on a nuclear, nuclear sub? Okay, I'm impressed. Iris, Iris Thomas has safely made it down. down. All right, with the U.S. Navy on rope A. She's also an aerialist slash trapeze artist. artist. Yeah. All right, and are wanting to be last today because she is that special, right? This is Teresa Davis. Look at that form right there. That beautiful form. That's Weezy slash Teresa Davis with American Savings Bank, the wealth coordinator there. Who uh, wants to give a shout out to all of her friends in the aerial class and all of her general friends who donated uh, and they sent her over the edge. And again, a great quote to wrap up the day was by Therese Davis, who at the end of her comments wrote, The special people we are raising money for today overcome daily challenges and struggles, and she is honored to be a part of their direct day. Therese, that's a great quote, and we appreciate that very much. And thank you so much for all you do. All right, and our last propeller of the day has safely made it over the edge. Congratulations to Teresa, Teresa, and Iris. All right, guys, we do have a live stream. Ladies, would you like to give a shout out to anybody out there in land, uh, internet land? Jason. All right, All right, thank, thank you so, so much, much Iris. <laughs> <laughs> and Teresa, do you want to give a shout out to any friends or family? You're like streaming. <laughs> All right, right, congratulations. congratulations. Thank, Thank you guys. guys. To all, all of our friends, friends and family, family and spectators who come, come out today, we appreciate you guys coming out and adding a level of excitement, excitement for all of our repellers and supporting them. Also, also to the thousands of donors who have supported our 100 plus repellers. We can't thank you guys enough for donating directly to Special Olympics Hawaii. We promise you that we will spend the money wisely and take care of our over 2,700 Special Olympics Hawaii athletes who participate year round in sports training and competition here in Hawaii. So thank, so thank you guys, you guys so much. much. Again, Again, before, before I, sign I sign off, a final mahalo. Let's give it up. A big round of applause for the Sheraton Waikiki. This, this is an amazing location to hold this event. We can't, we can't thank them enough for their support. Also, the folks are around the fire and Waikiki. Also, our hundreds of volunteers have made this event happen yesterday and today, including the Over the Edge Navy Rope Crew, Navy Rope Crew our Rope Staff, Rope Staff and the Blue Church Navy Rope Crew, Crew with the Hawaii Army National Guard, Guard and Rope Staff 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 Rope all of our volunteers, all of our mission partners, partners and event sponsors, sponsors. We, can't we can't thank all of you guys enough. And with, and with that, that, we will officially declare this 2012 Over the Edge event closed. And we look forward to seeing you guys again next year. Hopefully the repellers come back to it again next year. It looks something like it's interested. If you're interested in getting involved, let us know. And we'll be happy to get you guys signed up. All right, signing off. Thank you, everybody. Have a great day.